Hello, potatoes. Welcome to the top 10 bed defenses. Let's get right into it. Number 10 on the list is the layer. Basically, you just have a layer of endstone, then a layer of wood, then a layer of wool. It's just however many layers you want, you put them on. This is easy to make, easy to remember, but, but it's not the greatest. Number nine on this list is no bed defense at all. You have to be an absolute beast to do this, but it doesn't really work. Uh, anyone can come take your bed. It does make a good video though. Number eight on this list is the wool obsidian rush. Basically you cover your bed in wool and you rush straight to the middle to grab some emeralds. Once you come back, you get some obsidian, and you replace the wool for obsidian. After you do this, then you just cover your bed in wool, and you're all done. Number seven on this list is the water defense. Basically, you just build any normal bed defense, and then after you're done with that, then you put a trough around it and water on top of it. You can put the water way high up if you don't want people to remove the source block, but that is completely up to you. Number six is a little trick that I featured in one of my Bed Wars tips and trick videos, which basically you add another layer to the bed defense you already have and then build from the front and when somebody mines from the front, they have to mine through two wool instead of one, and it, it's just amazing. Bonus tip, you can combine this one with the layer, and this is actually what I do normally in Bed Wars, but it, it just makes an ultimate bed defense, so they have to mine through one wool, one wood, and then two endstone. <laughs> Number five is yet another trick. What you gotta do is you gotta make the bed defense to the side of the bed. So basically everyone will mine in and they'll wonder where the bed is, but it's actually on the side of the bed defense. This is hilarious. I featured it in one of my Bed Wars trolling videos. I highly suggest you try it. Number four is yet another troll defense. So basically all you need to do for this is make a box around your bed with a space in the middle that you can stay. And when someone comes and mines through, just hit them with a knockback stick. It's hilarious. Number three, one of my favorites, the spam bed strategy. Just cover your bed in something like endstone and spam wool everywhere nobody knows where to start when attacking this base it's it's actually better than it looks it's really good you sh you should try it there's no reason it's number three number two this one is the one i like to call the fountain basically you put wool on your bed go to the middle get obsidian come back and cover your bed with obsidian after that, you make a huge box around your bed and you fill the top part with water. Then you mine out the sides so the water flows down. You can also make a trough if you want to not want the water to flow everywhere. That happens a lot. But yeah, after that, then you just mine the inside and the entire inside of the bed defense is filled with water. This one is almost the best bed defense. <laughs> Number one on this list I call the everything, because it's almost everything we've done in this video. Pull around your bed, go to mid, grab obsidian, put an extra layer at the front of your bed. I used, uh, <laughs> I used endstone. But, yeah, then just layer it up, add a trough around it, add water way up in the sky, and you're done. Ultimate bed defense done. Thank you all for staying till the end of this video. Even if it was really boring, I hope you liked it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. And if you'd like to see more stuff like this, be sure to subscribe. I'll see you all in the next video or stream or whatever I'll do. 
Goodbye.